Someone came to see me the other day for a spider phobia and we had a really good session. We did about 20 minutes of work, a really simple technique, kinetic shift, which you may have heard me talk about on some of these other videos or may have seen around other people talking about it. There's lots of people doing kinetic shift these days. It's a very popular technique. So I did kinetic shift with this client and uh, we spent about 20 minutes working on a spider phobia and we went from unable really to even hear the word spider comfortably and uh, unable to consider the idea of even me hand over a plastic uh, spider that I had left over from Halloween. That was an uncomfortable experience for her at the beginning of the session. 20 minutes later, she's got a dead spider in her hand. I uh, tried to find a live spider, but was unable to find a live one, but still a dead spider in her hand, and she's looking shocked and unable to uh, quite believe that in 20 minutes we've made such a difference. So we did some more work before the end of the session. We, we finished the session and did some trance stuff because people come to see a hypnotist. They kind of, a lot of the time, they want to experience some hypnosis and uh, we hadn't actually done any anything that you would recognise as uh, trance work or hypnosis in that sense. Uh, so uh, we, we did some and sort of ratified the experience using these things, but it, it seemed very much after just 20 minutes doing a bit of kinetic shift and that the 20 minutes included sitting down and form filling and asking a few questions and all of that kind of thing seemed to all be sorted so so that was really nice and uh, the next day I got some lovely feedback and uh, the she told me that um, uh, she'd slept with a window open for the first time in many many years uh, which she hadn't been able to do because of her concern of spiders and a number of other things that she said that were very nice and she was very pleased with the outcome of our session. And I saw her on Facebook that day, she was advertising for, uh, has anyone got a tarantula or a big spider that I can uh, come and interact with? So I thought, well, this is fantastic. This is, this is awesome. I didn't think any more about it. On the Saturday, this was on the Wednesday, on the Saturday, I uh, happened to glance on, on Facebook. I was training uh, at the time, so I wasn't really checking Facebook or anything, but happened to notice this notif notification came up and she had uploaded a video. And I wanted to share that video with you because I think it's fantastic. So uh, this is Ella and her encounter with a rather large spider. I'm touching it. I'm touching it. <laughs> I'm touching it. There you go. Oh my god. Oh my Stay god. Calm. I'm actually Oh my god. I'm actually doing it. Wow. <laughs> wow. Sorry. That's alright. She's really cute actually. Oh my god. <laughs> How are you feeling? Oh amazing. I feel like I wanna cry. Jesus Christ. I'd, honestly, I'd have fainted before, wouldn't I? Oh, oh mate. Yeah, I'm holding a spider. <laughs> Big spider. Croak. Oh. oh, she's lovely. Don't get too close. <laughs> wow. She's actually doing very well. I'm sure you. She's chill, didn't she? I can't believe I'm doing this. I swear to God. Right? <laughs> You're talking. I couldn't even open have my bedroom window open, right? I couldn't sleep with my bedroom window open for 30 years. No, well, I mean. I had my first first experience with the window open all night. It's, <laughs> and now I'm holding a spider. No, I tried. <laughs> <laughs> I want to get one now. Uh. They're fairly cheap. Ah. Uh, thanks, bro. Yeah, So there you go, what a great video. And uh, you know, just a few days before, she couldn't even sort of hear the word spider without seeming to be uncomfortable. So uh, I'm really pleased to be able to share that with you. So thank you to Ella for allowing me to share that video. And uh, I thoroughly encourage you to check out, I'm gonna include a link somewhere below or somewhere um, uh, in the description or whatever to uh, Ella's music. Ella's a fantastic singer and uh, I'm gonna include uh, uh, a link to some of her music and some other stuff uh, that, that may also be relevant to with regard to this video. So thank you very much for watching and I uh, hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, uh, give us a thumbs up, leave a comment, tell us what you think and uh, subscribe to the channel. That would be lovely. I would really appreciate it. So thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.